Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Al. Welcome back to my channel. Or if you've not been here before, welcome in. Um, we're gonna be doing a bandmate today. I know it's been a while since I've done a reaction video for bandmate, but uh, they dropped this new uh, official live MV two days ago uh, for the song uh, "Don't You Tell Me." It's part of their performance at the uh, Yokohama Arena, and that's what we're gonna be doing today. So I'm really looking forward to that. Like I said, it's been a while and I really miss this uh, ladies. But before that, I just want to share like a little revelation that I experienced uh, recently. Uh, before discovering Bandmade and uh, listening to them pretty much every day, um, I got stuck in that era of uh, rock music of uh, the 80s and 90s. And, and that's pretty much all I listened to. Uh, but uh, since discovering uh, Bandmade and all these other wonderful bands, um, I kind of like uh, took a long break from listening to the uh, older stuff, right? The, the stuff from the 80s and 90s. Uh, but uh, when I was in my car driving home from work the other day, uh, in my Spotify, some of the older stuff that I used to listen to um, started, started playing, right, automatically. And um, I came to realize uh, that uh, Bandmate have changed the way uh, I listen to music. It changed the way I hear music and the way I kind of like, um, I don't know. It's just everything kind of changed to me. It's, it's kind of hard to explain, but things that I used to listen to uh, from the 80s and 90s that I used to love, right? And I still do, but it just doesn't sound the same to me. <laughs> I don't know uh, if a uh, bandmate spoiled me. Or, or they're just so good that uh, the old stuff that I used to listen to all of a sudden sounded really uh, basic or uh, standard. Or dare I say, even like boring. Like I still like them, but not as much as I used to. I don't know if that makes sense. But I just, you know, realized that bandmate just made me a little bit more critical, I think, when it comes to uh, music and listening to music and breaking down each instrument and hearing other parts of the song. It's kind of like I got conditioned to that, listening to Bandmade. It's a little weird, but uh, yeah. So that was uh, quite a revelation for me. It, it, music is just not the same for me anymore, and I don't think it's going to be ever be the same since uh, being a big fan of uh, Bandmade and listening to their music a lot. So I kind of like just wanted to share that. I don't know if you guys have experienced something similar, but you guys can tell me in the comments if uh, that's the case for you also. But anyway, enough uh, jibber jabber. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and listen to this uh, official live music uh, from Bandmade. And this is uh, Don't You Tell Me. One of my favorite official music video from them, by the way. I'm talking about the original music video. If you haven't seen it, it's one of the best in my opinion. Love the stage, love the lasers, love the crowd. And of course, I love Bandit. Turn this up. Psyche sounds great. Speaking of uh, Psyche and uh, how great she sounds, I just feel like out of all the members, uh, she's probably done the most growing or, or, or improving. Uh, she's always been a great singer, uh, especially after she had her polyp surgery. But I think she's just gotten so much better the last couple of years. Definitely last year. And she just sounded more powerful, sounded more in control. And just the presence of her on stage just phenomenal. Oh, by the way. If you guys notice uh, the harmonies that Miku is doing, like I can hear Miku, but I also hear some sort of a bass harmony, like a really lower registry uh, 
harmony. I don't know if that's also coming from Miku. I know that she can do that also, but I don't know if that's part of a track uh, with this particular performance or or that's also Miku doing different uh, harmonies with Psyche. It just sounded really good. <laughs> Rane with a double bass. What a great crowd. Getting this bumps all over. <laughs> what Akane is doing in the back. That is just awesome. Ah, oh, man. I just need a little break from that. I'm going to play it again because I know I talk a little bit over it, but I live for these moments when it comes to bandmates with a little back and forth battle, conversation, whatever you want to call it between Misa and, uh, and uh, Mincho. But man, I also love Akane in the back. She's not doing too much uh, with her playing, but... For some reason, it just kind of like highlights, amplifies the battle, right? She's just supporting the conversation between Misa and Mincho. But what she's doing just stands out to me. It just sounds really, really good, even though it just sounded kind of like basic, right? But it's just perfect for, for the whole thing. It just kind of like bring everything up. Like, like uh, it just amplifies the whole thing. It just makes it sound so good. So we're going to go back and I'm going to shut up so we can just... Enjoy the whole battle. <laughs> See if I can uh, find it uh, the right spot. Okay, this is going to be it right here. Oh, a little bit more. All right, just to be safe.
holy crap. Ah, sorry. I don't know why I got so emotional <laughs> in that little uh, battle they just did. But yeah, I don't know why. <laughs> Maybe I just miss him so much and uh, just so happy uh, to hear this. I just love that Mincho and uh, Visa are uh, at the very top of the rafters. Yes! <laughs> Woo! My gosh! Oh man, I wasn't expecting that I was gonna going to get emotional listening to and watching this video just came out of nowhere <laughs> i just love this band so much and uh what a great time to be alive and and, and uh have this type of music i've given up on um new rock music for the very long time and and and, and band made in a way kind of like um i feel reborn it's like my second coming as a as a rock fan and I really have a big part of that is is bandmade and I really do appreciate what they've done and that what they're doing and, and what they have uh you know in store for us to still uh come out. I'm just very excited for that. But anyway, thank you for watching you guys. Until my uh next reaction video, uh take care and have a nice day.